Hello, everybody. Welcome. Happy uh, day before New Year's Eve. I'm going to miss my Santa dancing um, to a rock song, to a rock, and, a rock jingle bells. Is that? Yeah, rock jingle bells. But I will be changing that in a couple of days, I guess. And probably most of you will be happy with no longer hearing any kind of Christmas music. Hey, Martin's mommy and Maureen, welcome. Good afternoon. So this live I'm going to do today is one that I'm sure everybody's going to do, but I've got some things I want to say, and I will probably be repeating some of the stuff other people are saying too, but it's just, um, just as I was watching it last night, I was just so freaking annoyed with him. So I decided I need to let it out today. Hopefully I remember everything I wanted to say from last night. That was a long time ago. But anyway, welcome to everybody. And also, if you are on the replay, welcome replay crew. As I say all the time, I am a great replay channel because a lot of the content I do is from the past. Or like I said, a lot of people will be reviewing this. But um, I am always here for the replay and uh, live, especially now that I got my new computer. I just want to stream. I'm just so... I'm loving this so much. Uh, so let's see. Also, if you have not signed to the petition and you would like to sign the petition because every signature, believe it or not, it doesn't seem like it helps, but it really, really built a lot of awareness and his sub count has really dropped. He likes to blame it on specific people and never on his own behavior. But I think the petition and his behavior – um, have really, and of, of obviously Danny Robinson have really gotten it up to the 3,000 signatures it has now. Um, it's like 3,050 signatures as of a few days ago when I looked at it. But um, every signature will continue to help bring more awareness. And if we can actually reach 5,000 signatures, it does have more of a possibility of reaching his local news. And wouldn't that be something if, if something like that could actually happen to really make people more aware of him? Hey, Nikki, welcome. So the petition to sign the petition is always in the link in the description box, which is either below you, beside you, or you're watching from your TV set and it's on your phone or your laptop. <laughs> So um, if you also know anybody that really hates a racist, it would be awesome if you just pulled out that uh, description box one day, pulled the link up, and had them also sign the petition. That would be a big help. And then also, if you would like to become a member of the channel, all memberships are greatly appreciated. I am doing some content, well, some other uh, commentary, not well, it depends on what you consider content. I'm doing other commentary on uh, um, another channel and kind of a little saga of what they've been going through with another creator from another community. And I'm going to be doing more of those because there is some more to add to that whole thing. So if you're not a member, you can become a member and you'll be able to get those member lives at either level. And all of the money goes directly back into the channel. So any donations would be appreciated, but never, ever, ever are necessary. You're uh, just watching the channel, clicking on the channel, even watching for a minute is very much appreciated. But if you would like to donate, then my PayPal, my Cash App, and my Venmo are all streaming um, where uh, all the little words on the ticker are below. And then also, you can do Super Chat, uh, Super Sticker, and if you're watching the replay and you would like, you can also do a Super Thanks. So, and as I said, all are appreciated, never, ever expected. And, uh, yeah, so let's see, what else do I have to say before? Hey, Peace and Cues, good afternoon. I think that covers all of the, all of the other stuff. And let's see, let me go ahead and get this pulled up, just a sec.
Oh my gosh. I just every, every live, it seems like we do in this community. It sounds like it happens to all creators. We all get, um, you set up the live and you turn a little monetization button on. And then it immediately, as soon as you start the live, it goes to limited ads right away, which means if it's limited ads, it's going to be barely any ads at all whatsoever. Um, and you basically won't get even any rat ad revenue from the live. So it does that every time I go live. So before I go and set up the video, I always go and I click and I want to click a button really quick to change it. But with my old setup, I could never ever get into the studio while I was attempting to even do a live. And it was so annoying because I would have to wait till later and Anyway, you guys don't really care about the back end stuff, but it's completely exciting that I can go ahead and switch that now for them to review before I go into the live. Yay. So now I am going and pulling up the live. I think covering Yates is probably a little part of it, but I think it's also just the community. I don't think it's people striking. A lot of people like to think that sometimes a bunch of people have struck them before the video, but I don't think that's what it is. I think it's just, um, oh, where did this go? Hey, Pally Pisces. <laughs> I don't remember that, Pally. I must have, wow, I don't remember that at all. Thanks for uh, saying that. Okay, let's see. Let me change and pull up. Where is this? Manage videos. Why isn't this? Oh, because I'm still on the wrong. I'm on the wrong thing. Okay, I'm such a... I shouldn't even be on creator. What is going on here? Okay, let me X out of this. So what was I doing? Okay, let's go. Lord, one of these days. Oh, I just thought I almost sang a Foo Fighters song. But I don't want to break your eardrums. Hey, Tina. Yeah, Nikki. Okay, now I'm on here, and let me see. Go into the library. Should be... Yep, here we go. Okay, good, I found it. And I also changed the uh, picture just a little bit. I brightened the picture up from last night. He's always so dark, I guess... He never invested in a ring light, and if he did, he doesn't turn it on, or it's broken, or it's cheap. I mean, I don't know, but it's so dark. So I brightened it up, and then I added a smoke effect. <laughs> so let's see here. Share stream. Share audio. Chrome tab. Oh, wait, I wanted to pull up something else too while this was going Oops. okay wait a minute let me go into another youtube real quick and find this so i've got it ready do you guys think as long as I give it commentary, would your crack elf mind if I played um, her arm history video? While, like, during, because JY talks about his arms and stuff, and he acts like we are all the stupid ones. And I would love it. If, hopefully, your crack elf won't mind if, when he brings that up, if I go in and play her video real quick and give some commentary just so it's connected. To this bullshit. Hopefully they will not mind. I should have asked. And I completely forgot until right now. 
Okay, did I share? Okay, I shared the screen. No, I didn't. I started to and then added that. Okay, so now I can pick this, share. It hurts his fake blue eyes. <laughs> Okay, let me make this subtitles and make it big. Oh, I might need to. Yep, I'll need to move that little Santa Claus dude or elf or whatever it is. Let's see. All right, let's rock and roll. Yeah, I kind of don't think so either, Pally, but hopefully, hopefully not. Okie dokie. Hey, crazy cat mama. Oh, thank you. Oh, Crazy Cat Mama, thank you so much. That means a lot. I really appreciate that. Yeah, the name change is a little confusing. Um, a lot of people have said that lately. I'm just, I am just figured out that Cooch and Dirty Bitch were the same person. <laughs> right? A blob of slime. No heart. Yeah. No soul. I agree. I, I concur. I agree with that 100%. <laughs> and thank you very much. Okay. Let me get to the screen and press play. You guys can see the smoky effect. <laughs> Let's see me. He's going to be silent for a minute or two. Well, not quite a minute or two, but it felt like uh, several, several seconds. No, I'm here. I'm here. I'm low. I'm here. Can you hear that? Okay. No, I would. You know, I would. Funny thing, I was looking at stuff. You know, it gets you at the end of the night when you like you, you just see a couple of things, it just really pisses you off. Well, oh, you know, because people want to report things now. Well, you can't have nice things. I'm looking for you for dinner. You can't. You can't have nice things anymore. Yeah, you can't. Good luck on that. So I opened the chat to everybody. Because I saw this text, which was just so funny to me. Thanks so much, Crazy Cat Mama. I do really appreciate that. And thanks, Pally. Hey, Valorian. <laughs> it was something in someone's community tab. And this I said, kind of this person needs to like stand up comedian right cody yes like uh, crazy yes 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 and i saw it and i said no john this can't be real and <laughs> alas it was same nikki <laughs> so let me get there for you watch out watch out watch out watch out watch out yeah so look at look at the, look at this look at look 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 at this comment. John Yates, when did we say you were evicted for not paying? Just pause that for a sec because I hate how it shakes when you're trying to read it. And I like to read stuff myself versus listening to somebody read it. I'm always like reading ahead of everything and reading it on my own. Um, when did we say you were evicted for not paying three months that your place was raided? It's what was said in our chat. Just like people say things in your chat but I don't go around lying and saying that you said it if someone else wrote it. Um, oh my God, that is such a lie. <laughs> because you've done that to me, Maria. <laughs> Completely. The only scammer is you. Let's remember June 14th. No, no. June 15th. No, no. December 10th. Hashtag John Yates. Hashtag grifter. Hashtag scammer. Hashtag liar. <laughs> 
Oh, and this whole June 14th, 15th, oh my God, okay. I'm not even going to get ahead of myself, but just the, the bullshit that comes out of his mouth is something else. Okay, let's continue. Pay uh -huh. three months that your place is rated. Like, these people. And let me let me recharge your memories. Games again. I'm going to talk to you. What are you talking about? <laughs> hey, Drago. I know, but it's Jane Jenless. I forgot for the day. So they officially kept out of the college. It was at least three months in rated. Okay, that's really way too fast because I have it sped up to 1.50 when I recorded it. But basically it is Anne saying that it was three months ago. Let me slow it down. He's going to play it several times, but I will slow this down, this part down. Let's see. It's... Mm. Hi, Jojo. I was three months. Place is rated like these people, and let me let me recharge your memories. Music fan, I'm gonna talk to you. What are you talking about? Mm -hmm. Let me talk to my fan. I know, but it's Jane Douglas. I was from the nest. So they officially kicked out of the college. It was at least three months in rent. Mm. Hi, Jojo. Oh, three months. Did you hear it? The three months. So Anne actually does say three months. <laughs> okay, let me get that back up to uh, normal speed because I am not to you, brothers. Huh? <laughs> John Yates, when did we say you were a victim for not paying three months? Where is Did that? you just not hear me play that just now for all y'all? Hmm? It's what was said in our chat. They're, they're blaming it on the chat now. Look, that's what was said in our chat, in their chat. Let me just one more time. Officially kicked out of the college and not paying three months of rent. Why am I not surprised? Hi, Jojo. You hear it a little bit better. Like once you know where she says it and when you hear her say at least three months in backgrounds. Or at least three months in rent, but referring to backgrounds. <laughs> It is. It's because somebody said it on um, one of the Reddits and everybody ran with it, I think. Or somebody said it in a chat and then Reddit got it and everybody ran with it. It's something. Did you hear that? Just like I did? Wow. 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 And y'all wonder why I don't go off the way I go off this firing at all fucking pistons morning or night man could you imagine having people lie the way they lie about me and then not having a reaction well it would follow the tradition of last year if so and the year before i imagine i don't have anything well 2019 i guess that goes into 2020 but i don't really have anything from 2020 into 2021 i don't think he must have been living though with HCJ at the time and had that apartment. That's right. That's probably why there's nothing really from that area. Okay. I mean, this morning, it says that uh, John's landlord had the cops at the cottage last night. John and Cody were at the cottage packing up, and the landlord had the cops there because I guess they were supposed to be out December 1st, allegedly. Holy shit. I, I told you. I told everybody. She knew it. She told everybody, guys. That one really cracked me up because nobody told anybody. Anybody with half a brain knew that his annual lease was up right around that time somewhere between November and December. We all knew that he moved in. So I do think that that's funny that somebody would think that they're the like the, the giver of, of that kind of information. <laughs> because we all speculated that because all of us have a brain that, that kept up with that more closely, but 
Yeah, there are a lot, pal. You're right. And that's really annoying. People sometimes want to just go with the, the the narrative that fits their enemy the most, which is like the worst thing, and they'll just go with anything, um, which is frustrating. Oh, do you really? Ooh. That would be awesome. I'm trying to work through some of the of last year's end of year stuff. I've got some really good stuff. But then I decided I wanted to play this today because I wanted to say some stuff. All right, let's continue. Last night, everything went down. I'm serious. I was just like, alert, alert. Where are the Kraft Brothers? Where is Tia Wall? Yeah. And I get somebody, where is Jake today? I get all these calls. And, and these are people getting off of people being homeless. Jules, you are a, a confidential informant for someone who ran a sex trafficking ring. Jules. Yep. Jules. Just Jules. You and your squirrels. The bee. Like, you turned state's evidence against your fucking boyfriend. So you wouldn't go to jail. And these are the people talking about me. Maria? Aren't there like some like bank discrepancies there somewhere? Brooke? Aren't you are or just were on probation for domestic violence against your husband? His cigarette blends right in with the smoke. <laughs> he is. Yep. Oh, God. All these people want to talk about me and my antics. And my antics. Brooke, didn't you, didn't you pass along those pictures of you and your black eye saying that it was you, your husband, but you were the one who got arrested trying to take the heat off of you, Brooke? Ask me how many times I've been arrested. This many times. I'm making sure you get a good picture of my wrist because that'll come into play. Why are you making finger holes? That's weird. <laughs> Agree, Nikki. Play in a second. But that's fine. It's fine. Hi, Mona. That tastes delicious. Really? Because I don't really like it. It needs more garlic, but we don't have it. Oh, I have more fresh. Like, Sorry, I couldn't make broccoli raw. I can't do. But could you imagine putting this in? Your yeah, he was trying to make a zero, but it looked like a um a hole that you would find in a rest stop, like Brooks Eye. The what is that? A glory hole. <laughs> the community tab saying John Yates tagging me, making me, making me look like like the bad guy. Look, they're tagging me. When did we say you were evicted for your for, for not paying three months? Again, let me remind you. I'm gonna talk to you. What are you talking about? Mm -hmm. Three months in rent. Hi, Jojo. Hi, Jojo. At least Chrissy got her money back. No, she didn't because she tried to rob a bank. Who did? Chrissy you hold up his wrist. By saying that uh, we frauded her because no one, that, no one, you know, you can't. And it's fine. It's fine. He was arrested at 18 in Long Island, breaking and entering. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Liar, you were arrested. Take your little glory hole zero and turn it into a one. <laughs> hey, Amanda. These people are saying it's been confirmed. Like, it's insane. Like, how these people have confirmed? Like, we were ejected from our house in the middle of the night, and here we are. Nothing just out of out of place, out of line, nothing. Wait a minute. Can I say something? Please. On this whole um, Chrissy D thing? Mm -hmm. What Chrissy Denver said there was not a pile of blood? Go to JY Evil Tax. You will oh, my God. See, number one, that pile of blood is from when Cody punched the flat top stove. The pile of blood. You already showed those pictures when Cody punched the flat top stove. We'll see the pile of blood. And we'll be showing it in just a few. Hi, Debbie. Things I didn't want to show. 
and now they're now, now they're saying which suicide attempt like they're making they're still making fun of suicide attempts. Um, now by saying it was the fourteenth, not the fifteenth, and I should I should I should die for that, which they're still wrong. But now now their argument is it's the 14th. oh my god! I just wanna I wanna I just want to strangle the truth into you, not physically because I am not a physically violent person, but I want to Minecraft strangle or something like like I just want you to. Stop lying! Like, are you kidding me? You're you were the one who said the fourteenth all along, and now you're acting like we are the damn idiots that made up the fourteenth and pulled it out of our own asses. When, sir, you're the one who said the fourteenth, and we proved you wrong. Oh my god, <laughs> that drives me. That just it really. I think that's the first thing that ran right through me and really pissed me off because he is acting like we are so dumb. How could we have ever thought it was the 14th? I mean, just like, seriously, are you kidding me? Why are you so? And again, I'm not physical, so I don't know how I want to get the truth out of him, but... <laughs> Like, for real, for him to act like, like, to insult our intelligence so offensively is, is just, it just, it really, really pisses me off because he's, he's just, oh my gosh. Okay, let's continue. <laughs> I'm going to play a little bit more of this and then I'm going to um pull up the Your Crack Elf video really quick and show the progression of these lies. So trigger warning to anybody. Um, oh, I don't have my banner up. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, it's up. But trigger warning to anybody for self-harm and things like that. Always trigger warning for anything, but especially uh, that with him. Okay, let's continue. Oh, my goodness. You just, you, sir, are such a jerk. 14th, not the 15th. And my bloody wrists and my pool of blood on the, on the which proved that we were right and not lying the whole time. Yeah. So now it's what? Tell me. It doesn't. Oh my God! Again, I just said the blood is from when he punched this when Cody punched the stove. It's not from anything you did. And you're the one who started off with the 14th. You and Julie. All the 14 stuff. And then the cops came and they found that you were at home and that you had never been and you didn't even go until the 15th. It was you, sir, that lied and tried to make everybody think it was the 14th. Oh. Okay, let's continue. <laughs> Thanks, Cody. Speak. Actually, no. I need to see you in private. Mm -hmm. Speak, Cody. Speak. Good boy. Oh, I guess now we're going to have a break while well, he does whatever he does. Let me read chat while he's breaking. Yeah, let me go ahead and pull up right now really quick. I'm going to play. So let's pause this. Let's go back to restream. And I'm going to play the Your Crack Elf video right now to show the progression of the arms. Because it's really important, I think, that, that people connect that he's like completely, he is, he is so insulting all of our intelligence. And Your Crack Elf really gave us this br video was brilliant they really gave us a a good way to grasp on to the the progression and the timeline of the risks and the things that happen and how he is lying about it so that's why i want to cover this really quick while i'm covering the other video because i think it's just important yeah and yep nikki I just think it's important that um, everybody see this. So you're crack off. I truly hope that you are okay with this. And if you're not, let me know how I can make it up to you. And I will do the fair use commentary, I promise. Okay. 
Let's see. And <clears throat> hey, YB, no, you are just in time. Care Bear, hello. Did I miss anybody else? Yep, Martin's mommy, Mona. I think I. Oh, hey, Moz. Okay. Let me uh, turn that on and let me speed this up just a little bit. I don't know um, if they've got it sped up, so let's just try 1.25. And let's play this real quick. Oh, wait, why is... Okay, why am I doxing myself? Go away. Oh, hey. Not really doxing myself. My name just popped up, but everybody knows my name, or I've told my name several times, so it's not really a dox. If it did show, but it didn't show, and I was, yeah, whatever. Okay, let me play this. Using those new pictures I had, which I which I showed. New pictures, huh? Why is he saying new? I think he's saying new, because something new just showed up. Something he's trying to claim has been there since June. Well, see, he's lived his life in the public. There's a good collection of videos since June. So we can see if this is new, or if, as he's trying to say, they've been there all along. I mean, they're on my wrist, see? Look, they're all fucking normal. They're all normal. So let's take a look at June through December and see if these new developments were here then. Here we are in July 3rd. That is so gross. <laughs> the monocle. He keeps showing his wrists. Beginning of June. Or July. Here on July 18th, we get lots of chances to try to see it, but try as I might, I just can't. Can you? Basically, what we are looking for, so of, for those of you that don't know, in in June he did um, vertical, um, like similar to like a cutter type of stuff. It looked like. But then he says now that there was also a, a, a deep horizontal one that was also done in June. But nobody saw the deep horizontal one and, until very recently in December when Julie told him to cover his wrist. And then he put out some pictures and acted like they happened in June and acted like the blood splatter was that from June when the blood splatter was from Cody and the really deep horizontal gash. Your crack elf is proving in this video didn't happen until December. I said it backwards. Your crack elf is here. Oh no, you're clapping, not waving. <laughs> what did I, how did I say it backwards? Let's see. Oh, I messed it. I missed vertical and horizontal. Oh my gosh, I always do that. I confused my I confused my up and down and my sideways. Okay, so horizontal is right to left and vertical is up and down. <laughs> your crack elf is awesome, everybody. Please, please subscribe to your crack elf. Um, let me see if I've got the link to drop. I'll look for that link as soon as I start this video again to make sure if you're not subscribed, you do subscribe to your crack elf because they work so hard and they have the most fun, adorable voice and they give us the straight facts and put it together, uh, in a comical way, in a serious way, in whatever way that we need. It's always perfect. And let's continue. 
And yes, what I just said for the descriptions, I meant the opposite. It was the, the right to left that were done in June and the up and downs that were done in December, just so there's no confusion. <laughs> Horizontal, the horizon, right? Oh, Martin's mommy, huh? Muzz, thank you so much. You always beat me. Tilda Swaggins. Yeah, they are pretty good. I've seen a couple of their videos. I think I recommended their channel. Um, I need to go check out their most recent videos. All right, let's continue. <laughs> so they're dancing and really showing off the wrists right now. <laughs> now it's August, even with all that bright sunshine, I still don't see it. Pippi, hi. Petty dragon fruit. So September 14th, there's Heading still... into September now. We no get vertical. several chances this month. What do y'all think? Can you see it? Well, there's Stinky Fish. Stinky Fish, do you see it? <laughs> it's my favorite part. <laughs> Stinky Fish, do you see it? <laughs> boop, 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 Yes, don't forget. You can see the horizontal ones right there pretty September well. September 22nd. Not even when he tries to give us a little hint. Yeah, if that doesn't prove that the it wasn't there. Almost October. Still haven't seen it. <laughs> She's so cute. Or they are so cute. Hug the infamous Starbucks weapon. There's the tape. <laughs> and still nothing. It's nice that the, a lot of this is silent so I can commentate over it. Thank you, your crack elf. <laughs> It makes it easier. Still, October 14th, nothing. Both wrists. Here we are, all the way to November. We don't have much time left to try to find it. Tragedy pimpin'. <laughs> huh. I don't hold grudges. What a liar. That shirt, are you kidding me? <laughs> it's the last day of November, and they still haven't shown up. I guess they were new, after all. Oh my gosh, so still the end of November, nothing. But Jen can tell you, oh. I, I, I sent her those pictures months ago. We all know that she can't, because we just saw it didn't exist. And if Julie was here, she would tell you the same. Isn't it amazing how he just assumes his friends are gonna lie for him? Even the ones who are always getting on live saying, I don't lie. I haven't lied about anything. What you gonna do? Cancel scamming John Yates. So, there you go. Um, I haven't seen anything going on, Muzz. But you don't, I know you're the only mod in here and you got stuff to do. So, let's see. Um, right now I think I'm okay.
unless anybody wants to volunteer. Okay, let me pull up. If somebody wants to volunteer, then awesome. But I don't want to. I don't want to force mod ship on anybody or put anybody into pressure. Yeah, draws would be great. Pippi'd be great. Okay, cool. Hi, Sarah. Pippi, is that okay with you? Oh, Nikki, thank you. Okay, great. Awesome, you guys. Thank you so much. Nice, Sarah. <laughs> okay, let me pull this video back up. So now you got the uh, gist of, <clears throat> of John's actual pattern of not having the up and down one until December. My brain is just stopping. <laughs> Vertical. Because horizontal is right to left. Okay. Lord. Thank you. Is he really YB? Which, um, I haven't really followed Brazil like close lately. Is he the one that was outed a while ago or the one, uh, or did they just out the one that outed the other one? I got a fuck from Sarah. Hell yeah. <laughs> hey, Star. Okay, let's share this audio. We are back to the big screen. All right, let's get back into this one. Oh, that's right. He's got us on silent still. Sorry, and I wanted you know I wanted people to come up here because you know I have no limitations on the chat and tell me how I'm a scamming liar because I don't want to go into 2023 with this. So if you have any questions for me right now, tell me, tell me how you're a redditor, and you can understand the fact that Jansen was a Johnson and Johnson's vaccination. Uh, how you said I how I, I committed felonies for improperly showing a vax card. Show, tell me Reddit, tell me how how people need to keep my antics in check. Tell me how there was a police raid here. Tell me how the, the tampons never came. Tell me how my mother never committed suicide. Tell me how Cody wrote her... I don't think anybody said the tampons never came. Lord knows. Everybody knows the who sent the tampons. You mentioned tampon gate every other breath. I just... Right, and he doesn't read Reddit. Of course he reads Reddit. <laughs> He was begging Reddit people to come up there last night, but none of the actual Redditors with brains were going to click the link. Right, Nikki. No. Yeah. What's with every, everybody thinking that everybody's talking about their moms? People are crazy. Him and his, him and his twin are both fixated. <laughs> Probably where he got it from. Suicide. No, tell me, tell me, tell me, Reddit. Tell me how, like, you have caught me in all these lies over the years. I would love one brother to come here right now and tell me. Tell me. Pippi, I think they I'm were, Pippi, I think they were regular sized tampons and it was a bag of, like, Vagisil tampons. Um, Oh my gosh, what else was in there? Vagisil, tampons, like a whole bunch of feminine stuff was in there. And they left it on his door.
And I was a hag at the time, and I remember we played Price is Right with all the all the contents that had come. Drazo, he got super chat. Drazo, oh my gosh, YB, I meant to say. He got super chats. I don't remember if there were any on this one or if it was the two-hour live he did before this. He put the Vagisil, he rubbed it on his face, I remember. Like it was face cream, I think. Yeah, Instacart, or yeah. I mean, it would be scary to have random stuff sent you to your door, but he made it seem like it wasn't Instacart. He made it seem like it was just somebody he knew dropping it off. But it was a legit service. (laughs) Yeah, she's still around somewhere, YB, I'm sure. Hanging out. one thing right now learning you have hodgkin yes. lymphoma can feel Commercial. overwhelming but you can rise to the challenge with its cetrus plus avd oh, for hand? adults as a first treatment for stage Sorry. three or four classical hodgkin lymphoma i don't know how long it took me to realize there was an ad going and to skip it so i just muted it oh let's see Oh, I let this go pretty far. Well, that's crappy. He got paid for ads I let run. Damn. I was doing other stuff while I was recording it with the chat. I'm going to tell you one thing right now. I'm not going into this next one. Last night when I recorded it, I didn't have the chat uh, with it. So I re-recorded it today with chat. I know, right? The, ma- the, the magic shrooms, the fake magic shrooms that I sent him from Amazon. <laughs> it's fucking year with this bullshit. So here's your fucking chance. Yeah, Mona. Not gonna okay. happen again. Nobody wants to hear it next year. It's the same bullshit. Go write somebody else's fucking house. Tell me, there's no, you know, anyone can chat. Cody just said, no one wants to hear it next year. None of that bullshit. Go write someone else's fucking ass. Can you guys take your own advice? Please. Nobody wants to hear it next year, John. It's that to anybody. So you tell me how I need to be held accountable when you said like that, like, like me and Cody. Nikki, I sent him um, because he was giving me such a hard time with the mushrooms. I sent him from Amazon something called magic mushrooms, but it was basically just some kind of a mushroom spice that was legal because it was through Amazon. But I wanted to freak him out and make him think I was sending him magic mushrooms. But it didn't work. He never even mentioned it. (laughs) And then I was mad. I wasted my stupid money on trying to freak him out. Move to Ohio with all our pets and our fish with mobile fish tanks and this shit and this that shit to like to have a vacation at the Motel Six in San Francisco for a fucking month. You tell me this. Come on, tell me how. Tell me about those antics. I would a love vacation. to hear about those. Yes, that's a vacation. I would love to hear it. Going over bridges with goldfish. <laughs> tell me how I robbed everybody. Please, and I'm here. pretty well documented john how you've robbed everybody i mean i guess it's not technically since they gave it willingly but you sure did scam them i mean you weren't truthful with what you needed it for and then to have somebody give you twenty thousand dollars the same day that they're getting out of the hospital is or were they or was she still in the hospital way back when when that twenty thousand exchanged hi sandra hi thank you for the horizontal vertical tips Oh my gosh. Sandra, I love that. A vertical, a virgin stays on her feet horizontal. The whore works on her back. <laughs> hey, Clark. I'm running my channel with talking about suicide. Well, girl, you're in the chat. Be a big girl. Type the whole word out. Um, 
I'm so sorry, but you need therapy. I, oh my God, like people like this. I know. Look at this one. Look at this idiot. Girl, please. Girl, please. Like, look at this idiot. This is someone who I've never heard from before, who is now an insider on my channel saying, I run my channel about talking about suicide. You're an idiot. Just because a creator has never heard of somebody doesn't mean that somebody hasn't not been watching all of your stuff. And maybe it's the first time they finally decided to say something. And she's not, or they, Devin Rex is not wrong. It says, John, you are ruining your channel with talking about S. A uh, sad face. I'm so sorry, but you need therapy. I understand you have had so much trauma, but why do you keep talking about it? I know, right, Pally? Exactly. Somebody's an idiot for saying that he needs therapy. That he needs more help than just freaking always bla blasting on about it on YouTube and making up lies. Sorry. Next. See, and here's like, there you go. For fuck's sake, bye. You're done. Well, if you've watched me for years, you would have known that my channel's been ran by nothing but, like, huh? Uh, Devin, Devin Rex. So, Devin Rex, how long has my channel been a suicide-based channel, in your healthy opinion? Never. Right, Sarah. He needs it more than oh. um, I mean, we all need it, but he. But they all level, ran with it. That's the thing. The level he needs is higher than some, lower than some. But you're right. Who doesn't? Of course they do. And they bash you. Oh, the only person I saw some accountability for like what happened was this weird person no one's ever heard of called Laura of the Light, who was a deceased Twitter user from 2017. So but nobody wants to say how much money they made off doing lives about me being homeless. Nobody wants to talk about that. Did he just say the only person on Reddit that that stood up for him was a, de a deceased Twitter user from 2017? That made absolutely no sense. I always click... Uh, too late. Where's all that? Where, where, you know, all these people. Remember the AT2 thing when I was like the 10th in line to talk about like a rumor that was going on? Remember what the fire I had to walk through because of that? And you have about 40, 50 people ahead of me in that line? Doing the same fucking thing, taking no sure. accountability in the middle of Christmas, saying that me and Cody were thrown out by the cops in the middle of a night raid because we hadn't paid our rent in three fucking months. Could you imagine? No, okay. But they wanted me to walk through that fire. But now not oh, one okay. person, but but some bullshit they Redditor with, with no face or no name is taking accountability. No, no, no. Not anymore for me. Those days are done. There's your accountability. What a joke. Devin, didn't block you. Okay, I'm not, listen, you're trying to make this live about suicide, which I'm not. You you had in your head that this might might turn about suicide, which it's not. I know it's not. And now you're continuing, I'm, I'm over it. Okay. So, uh, don't tell you. But where's like, the, you know, calling, you know, calling the, the, the Mavis discount tire from a year ago when I got my tires fixed. Asking, calling some, some repairman that probably just started there. Say, well, did you work on this car? Well, I don't know. Well, did you know if it was towed? Well, I don't, well, no. Like, it's, it's so fucking crazy. Sorry about that. I was trying to figure out if I could move my avatar box over to something that wasn't covering the chat and i'm having issues right yb he cannot use that anymore he did show us them on purpose
This channel is about grifting. How do I grift? How am I a grifter? Do you know what a grifter means? Tell me how I'm a grifter. I would love for somebody who knows what the word grifter means They're to tell me what a grifter the is. The is Thought Pony what you call his Mustang? That's freaking hilarious. Oh my God. Right now. Tell me what a grifter is. So I could to so pointly put you in your place real quick. Magic Monroe here knows. That's Maria, by the way. Hey, Maria, why don't you tell us what a grifter means? So your, your hashtags make sense in your head on your channel. What's a Ma grifter, Magic Monroe? How does he know Magic Monroe is Maria? That's funny. Oh, my God. Look at it. Choose recovery, John. Yeah, choose. Is that different? I, choose. I... It's probably like just. God. So, Magic Monroe, tell me, what's a grifter? Who am I conning? <laughs> when I slit my wrist in June, no, I never asked anybody to take up for me. I never, I had. Oh my gosh, Nikki, that is hilarious. One hot pony. Thought Pony is hilarious, and oh my goodness, that's so funny. Exactly, Pippi. He is that, and that's... <laughs> he qualifies. I had no idea that people went live about it. Oh... Okay, I can't fast forward 15 seconds, so. I had no idea that people went live about it. I had no idea that my lot, my, that my channel was struck over it up until two weeks later. Nice. No idea. I never asked anybody for help. Nope. I had no idea that anybody went live. So. There was no GoFundMe. There was no. I never went live and said, "Please help me." It was people who wanted to cash in on my name. Yep. Who made magazine articles and and had cast reach out to them, and they felt all special. And uh, I never asked anybody to do anything. The people who I thought were my friends used that against me to further their channels and their names, and that's it. I never asked anybody for any type of help at all. I wanted to die. That was it. How did they use you? Brooke had connections herself also to 90 Day People because she's one of the ones that as soon as a new cast list comes out, she was sending messages to all of them as soon as they find out the cast. So Brooke was able to make her own connections through 90 Day. And if she actually decided to do content, she wouldn't necessarily need you for that. Um, Marie and Anne have no intention of doing 90 day content. And the only time they even had somebody 90 day on their channel was in regards to you and trying to help you and your sorry butt. When they had that one guy on from Australia. Oh, I forget his name, but, uh, hey, Gina Marie. But I don't see, I mean, you full-heartedly use these people to further whatever agendas you had in your mind. And in return, they got some of your subs. <laughs> so you now want to act all big and mighty, like, I gave you all of these subs and blah, blah, blah. I'm, I'm so, bene so benevolent. <laughs> oh, interesting, Nikki. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, that one I'll give you. But she doesn't have a channel. But yeah, that one you're right. And just by being his friend, Ash, that's right. Because she loves to get up and talk to all these people too and, and be all up in the, the excitement of knowing somebody, you know, on the Z list. What more do you want? 
Sheena Marie, I remember that. Did I answer that correctly? Like what? Like, I don't know, is there any more? Like, just let me know. Now they're saying like you know it was a different day, like you know because they all have this in the head that they they called the police and the police were paying and this that and the other and. They worked real hard developing a story that wasn't there. And then when I couldn't take it anymore and showed all the real fucking pictures, everything that we said was true. I know Christy never could sleep at night. There was no puddle of blood. And I showed the puddle of blood and there it was. And then what's she going to say? Well, then Again, the puddle of blood is from when Cody punched the flat top stove. And that's been proven. And we just proved the arms. Well, we didn't prove your crack elf gave an amazing video of proving how the arms were didn't have the up and down slash the the um horrors on your back the vertical slash oh my gosh the vertical slash uh till december the date was wrong what it wasn't the 14th it was the 15th it's I thank you, sarah i appreciate that I don't know what fucking date it was. I, again, wasn't going live and recording it. And for these people to say, and, and now they're, 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 they're posting my wrists as like baseball cards. People are saying, I don't want you to talk about my essay attempt. I don't want you to talk about this attempt and this attempt and that this is off limits, but everything's on limits when it comes to me. Right. So now it has to be like, well, which, 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 which do I attempt was this? There was just the one. But the people who have been lying, like the people who have been saying that, like, I don't know, we just got raided and, and, and we trashed our fucking house. I mean, in a comment tonight or two days ago, Maria said, when did we say you were evicted for your house from not paying rent for three months? In a community tab, was, like, I'm a liar. Like, I'm a fucking liar. Like, I just don't get it. You are a liar. Maybe you weren't lying about that. Maybe somebody else was. And unfortunately, that just makes people see you as the victim that you are not. But you are a liar. Like, I'm a liar. Brothers, come for me at 6 a.m. I'm going to talk to you. I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. I'm going to talk to you. I'm going to talk to you. I'm that's it right there saying we were just kicked out of the comments for not paying rent in three months he is really stuck on the fact that um <laughs> that Anna and maria said that he uh owed three months of rent and them saying that then they didn't say it and now he's proving that they said it and he plays this over and over he's kind of obsessed with this exactly way too much <laughs> And, and she is saying any tab. It was people in the chat saying that. And I tried to reach out to, to some people in the chat because they followed me first. And they are just like hook, line, and sinker in the shit. How could you say, how could you, how could you offend somebody saying, oh, John Yates is making this up about me. We never said that. And there's your own fucking voice saying it. And like, it's like an epiphany because like, you know, these people that like, you know, run these hate channels, they're hate channels. They don't want to make peace with anybody. They just want to make shit up about people over and they got to be making shit up and, and then they make shit up and it, it just, it never, it never fucking ends. And they're making an income from this. <laughs> about a bunch of bored housewives that just can't like, it, a revolving door of people. Are you kidding about making an income? I mean, the amount of money that you made, like in 20, 20 uh, 22, you made upwards of a hundred grand from your grifting. It's insanity. Well, 80 grand of a grifting, I mean, and then the rest, I mean, super chats and maybe up to a hundred and then super chats and all of that stuff. But that's insane that you made that much money and you're talking about everybody else. Exactly, Pally. He is allergic to receipts. Because he doesn't have any to prove anything. Like, hate, hate Johnny Mac. Love Johnny Mac. Hate John Yates. Love John Yates. Hate Sophie. Love Sophie. 
Every day it's a different it's it's a different fucking color in the jukebox. And then all these people are like, okay, hate, love, hate, love, hate, love, hate. Like, you know, it's like fucking something out of the Twilight Zone. And they're like trying to like continue to make it seem like I'm a liar. John Yates is lying about us. We never said he was evicted. It's your own fucking voice. Was that Anne in her chat saying that live? Can someone spell this out for me? Oh my god, these people are fucking sick. Like, sick to, like, the next fucking level sick. That's like me saying Anne gave me, like, chlamydia. And like, yeah. Where is the accountability? There's no accountability. So much so that they're lying, saying, we never said that. <laughs> Oh my god, Lisa Marie, you want to come up and school me on this, Lisa Marie? Here's a link. You come up and school me on suicide. Go ahead. School me on suicide. So Julie just took it upon herself to raise the money because that's bullshit that he can't take any accountability for what Julie did and allows Julie to be thrown under the bus so badly. Yeah, right, YB. I mean, that's really some crap. That Julie just did that exactly all on her own. That's bullshit. Right? Yep, Emily Lodge. Yep. Oh, was it Nikki? <laughs> I fell asleep. I always fall asleep. Um, like closer to the beginning of her lives because <laughs> they're so late. School me on you guys passing around pictures of my wrist and taking notes on them. School me on that. Nikki, that's what makes you think he has to be getting a cut of it. Or she has to be getting a cut to be so stupid. Call me on it. Um, Velvet Pixie in the chat just accused people of having the Walt Disney syndrome. Are you kidding me? To the man who has 20 million Care Bears on the back of his couch and all of this Harry Potter crap and everything else, and you're uh, saying other people have whatever this Walt Disney syndrome is? Oh, my gosh. I like Velvet. Oh, Lord. When I was a hat. Hi, Wanda. Hello. Hi. How are you? Um... I'm, 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 ah, John, switch the candle, fuck's sakes. What is Wanda doing? It looks like a smoke detector that, like, you just press all over the broom. His facial expressions are kind of funny with her. At one point, he looked so irritated. I think that's your smoke detector, Wanda. I think you're okay. I think you beat it. Yeah, John. I, I, think, I think you won that battle, Wanda. I, I think you do. I think you did. Yeah, but you showed my funny face. Yeah, and she sounds a little wee bit uh, like she's been imbibing. Do I know if Jen... Listen. Again, I sent those pictures to a bunch of people. Some more recently than others. Like, I don't care, honestly. Like, you saw my wrists. They were bloody. And there's no way I could have done that damage to myself more than once in, in the scope of four months because my, my hands would just be dangling, okay? So, no, hold on, hold on, one. Um, there, there's no way that I've done that damage to myself twice in that amount of time, okay? Uh, but go ahead, go ahead, Wanda. John, I'm not yeah. here. I'm not here to talk about the, the, the photos and the whatever. What I'm oh my gosh, is, Wanda. And this is 
Wanda could never prove to him, go head to head with him and prove that he's lying about his scars. <laughs> I don't think that's what her, her intent was, but that's what he thought it was. And Drazo, that's hilarious, the drunken thumper. <laughs> They start at the bottom of my heart, even though you block me on your bloody um, on your, on your whatever. No, no I'm not blocking you anywhere. I'm blocked. You're yeah. here right now. Yeah, I'm blocked. I was a member. No. And you know why? And, and you know why, John? Well, do you know why I, I subscribe to you? Because I enjoy your commentary about the Real Housewives. Well, I appreciate that. Yeah, yeah. So I know what happened, um, with all this hate and everything else. By the way, I've never ever hated you, okay? That sounds wonderful. Yep. And now you see, now the check, now they start to stir. Officer Bella. I am not I am not Officer Bella. And Empress Hilla. She thinks hold on, hold on. Wait, listen, like it's we just drove, you saw me driving in the car. Like there's no way I could have done that damage to myself so close and proper. Officer Bella in the chat says, and that's why Julie texted you and said, pull your sleeves down. It's exactly why Julie texted him and said it. And now he's all like, oh, God, I got to explain this again, how I could never possibly ever do that, even though I'm lying. Proximity, but it's fine. Like, be, like just like uh, the same people getting mad at me for not being evicted from my house because you said I was. Yeah. Like, wh what yep. is it? Tell me. No, no, why not? No, I'm not talking no. about the people in the chat, like, who are just trying to, like, say, like, no, how can I be driving a car if I had just done that? Um, Empress thinks I'm drunk. And Officer Bella, what the fuck? Why are you talking to about me, Wanda? Ish. I'm not talking to you, Officer Bella. I'm talking to John. I think Wanda actually thinks Officer Bella is the real Bella. Because <laughs> her and Bella have their own little war going on. <laughs> Why can't we just have those two fighting all day on a stream? <laughs> At least one night. That would be fun. Just to have one night of a stream of the two of them going back and forth at each other. Well, I think you should drop down because I think it's, um, I'm kind of re reacting to people in the chat. And I don't want you to... Where are from? She has a South African accent. Yes, I am. I am. But I don't want you getting more upset than you need to be right now. Um... John, I'm not... Do you know why I'm getting upset? Guess what? Because I want you to go back to your content. And I am. It's the end of the year. That's why I'm doing this right now. Like, listen, this December has been a blur. There's been a lot going on in this month. I want you to go back to doing your contact, darling. And you know what? I love the way, um, um, you know, with the way you, um, the commentary on, on Erica Jane. Well, Beverly Hills will be starting probably around April, but Jersey's starting soon, soon. So yeah. there we so, go. And the way, and the way you, the way you can, um, the way you do, Teresa, on the Little Housewives of Beverly Hills. Well, Teresa's on New Jersey, but yes, I love doing Teresa too. But, yeah. um, but thank you, Wanda, for, for so coming. So, John, can we please stop with the hate? What hate? Can we please stop with the hate? What hate? The hate. Which hate? What, what hate? Do, what hate am I giving out that I, that I need to stop on? Um, can you? Can you? In fact, can you tell your moderators to? Because they blocked me. Because they blocked me. I was. I was a regular follow of you. Yeah. So. Uh, there we go. Right. We'll, 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 you know what? If you guys are going to continue with this, we'll be. Jen's in the chat going off on, on Wanda, but this comment's particularly funny. She says that Maria can go F a cactus. <laughs> but Jen, you are so vulgar. You're so vulgar. Why? Why does it have to always go back to vulgarity with you? with me, whatever. Wanda asked Maria that. Guess what? I'm here on my own. I'm here on my own. Okay. Me. Why don't you just fuck off, okay? Wait, are you telling me to fuck off? No. Oh, okay. Well, I'm like, shit. Yeah. I'm not here. Am I here with Maria? No, I'm not. I'm not. For fuck's sakes. Don't worry about it, sweetheart. For fuck's sake. John. The thing that's different about a verbal vacation home, you always have the whole... 
God, I did so bad at this. I was <laughs> doing other things. <laughs> Actually, I was probably on Instagram messaging people <laughs> while this was recording, not paying a bit of attention to it because I was all up in my phone. Wait for it to play off. Jane comes. Oh, want to go go to AA? Guess what? Guess what, Jane? Okay, you know what? This is getting Guess away from us a little bit right now. Jane? Guess what, Jane? Why do you fucking sit on it? Okay, we're good. Wanda, yeah. thank you so much for coming up. She's um, got not more people. It was nice to hear from you again. Yeah. Wanda, only John is allowed to cuss out people in his chat. Nobody else. <laughs> and. And now he's on a break again. Oh, wait, no, do I have it paused? Okay, I know where she yeah. went. Okay. But that was nicer from Wanda. Um, I like Darby. She's fun. I like Wanda. Cody. I think Cody is just like a trained dog that is always in the background whenever John says something nice about somebody. Then Cody's going to be like, oh, they're so sweet. Or, oh, I like them. Or, oh, you know, he's, he's always going to be the the parrot to whatever John says. It's so annoying. The oh yeah, post season. Like, listen, like I don't know what you want from me. No, Wanda. No, you're done. No more backstage, Wanda. Stop. I'm gonna eat soon, John. We have to get up in like five hours. You know, it's funny with the suicide stuff, like it's, you know, it's the same stuff as like, you know, us being evicted. And, like, these people lie over and over and over and over and over and over and over again. And like, they just make like the world's worst, like not like, you know, oh, John Yates like didn't like button his top button. No, John Yates had, was raided and evicted and the police came in the middle of the night and did this, oh, that, and the oh. other. Chody wants a cracker. <laughs> That's funny. Hi, Whitney. Hey, um, I've always wondered about your eyes. Why do you keep wearing colored contacts? They're enhancers. <clears throat> I've had them like since I've been like 14, so like I'm kind of used to them by now. But yeah. So even when you have like the eye problems, you still wear them, right? I don't have eye problems. Like you had them before. It's okay. Anyways, about no. Jen thinks that Wanda is way bigger of an alcoholic than John. Because he she is in the comments now saying, and they call you an alcoholic. <laughs> and Whitney Lee just cracks me up. Her opinions crack me up and now that she took she clicked the link i am just like dying i love whitney lee just i love me some whitney lee <laughs> whether i agree with her or not she is always always entertaining i don't have eye problems your eye was so red and shut and you kept wearing them anyways about the arms so it's really obvious people have pointed out the obvious in June, they were like slashes to the side. Afterwards, you can even check this on YouTube, your crack elf or whoever posted it. Uh, in November, then different, and like the slash was in different directions. So people are wondering about the difference. And what difference might that be? <laughs> she just like told you. you. slashed your arms differently in different months. And what are the two months in question? So, okay. You sent them in June, right? Well, no, wait, you're telling me. You're 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 coming to me with this. So I want you to have your facts straight before you come to me with this. So No, everybody said. Again? Everyone. Well, no, well, you're speaking for everybody. So there's a lot of there's a lot of, you know, stuff on your shoulders right now. So you better get this right. <laughs> Do you drink like a lot? Well, is that part of the the last question ah. that you just asked me or are you just like, you know, which is the question that you want to hone in on? I agree, Nikki. She really does have a lovely accent and she's in um i think ontario so i can't figure out what like because it almost i first i thought she was like french canadian and then she said ontario 
So I don't know, but she does have an amazing accent. And she's so funny because she basically told him in June, your arms were, were one way. And then by the end of November, or December, they were had the other is what she's saying to him. But she can't break that, break it down exactly. And he's being such a dick. And now she's like, how much do you drink? <laughs> ah. Let's continue. Is my question to you. And like, does mean drinking or not drinking make you understand that question more or less, Whitney Lee? Look, it's basic. There are two sets of pictures. It's very basic. You sent... Okay, let's forget. Wait, what you wait, said. wait. Well, I I sent who who did I send and what Whitney Lee? Okay, let's say to who. No, no, no. you're coming to me with very factual evidence. Trying. To yeah, YB. It doesn't really matter. It is. It is lovely. I just like listening to her. To prove me wrong, so it's not. Let's say it's not hearsay. It's let's speculate. You're coming to me with stuff that you want to. You have the. You have the evidence I against me on it. So bring it i'm a viewer like all the others just wondering about the same with, question with the same law degree all the other viewers have whitney so go ahead no you're a public figure you need to make this clear are you sure about that well you have like people that view you they don't know your past they don't know your fights and they're like watching this and wondering why you're going all so crazy and fighting with everybody and you're would, not clear you would consider yourself an insider to that then whitney because you you're a viewer as you've it's said been put out there by everyone well who's everyone Okay, so the DMs with Julie have been exposed. Well, which DMs with Julie? Can you can I can I put these DMs up on the screen? <laughs> you need to let Maria come up and explain this. Uh, Maria, who? <laughs> well, listen. Poor Whitney. She doesn't have like the actual. He wants. He just wants her to show proof, and she doesn't have like she's not prepared. I mean, she's not a content creator. She doesn't have a fucking file on you, John, where she's just ready to pull up your crack elves video and then the proof of the blood and all of this other shit. I mean, yeah, he's completely deflecting and he's being a dick. Listen, you know, when you first came on, I thought you might have a case against me, but it seems like you're just like kind of talking in circles, right? Did you hear that? When you first came on, I thought you might have a case against me. It's like he's busting himself. When you first came on, you kind of made sense, but I sure as hell got you off that quick and, and, and got you other places and thinking and deflected enough that now none of it makes any sense of what you're saying. Wow. <laughs> right now, I'm like, I, I, I'm, right. I like, why, you came here, why are you here in the first because, place? Because there are so many questions and like people- No, that's not, no, no, that's not how you phrase it when you first came up here, Whitney. Can Cody just say girl by girl? I, 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 would, I would like, listen, I've been entertaining you this, this you now. Bye, girl, bye. What's the question? And who made I've, you do that? I've been asking you, and you your story, your story is changing. Over your husband. Tell us now. So, Freddie, come on, Winnie. Cody, no, why did you please, choose please. Indiana Jen over your husband? I didn't pick Jen over my husband. I'm Jen with who? my husband. <laughs> did you know that it was why so funny you... when Cody Why did you pick home to you, Jen, over your husband? <laughs> Her. <laughs> she's really good though because he tries to get her off and tries to make her out to be a fool and then she just comes back with an even better question like that's even more hilarious to make him look even more like the asshole like this is brilliant he said you prefer drugs over him when john said that yeah that was that was that hilarious. was so yeah. funny i'm like, laughing to watch you. Like you right now you create this craziness yeah, it's so crazy. I'm totally to on board with, with everything you're saying. And after you left Jen's house, you started making this like whole scenario of she was like this monster, and we were like, "Oh wait, oh, oh, you're talking about Home Depot, Jen? Oh uh -huh. wow, oh, yeah. this one wants to go. Yeah. Wow, you you. Who didn't realize? Well, I mean, anybody at right history lessons exactly, Nikki, and anybody who already knew the history knew immediately she meant Home Depot, Jen. There was never a question of her talking about the Jen that's in the chat. It, <laughs> It took him long enough to catch on. I assumed he knew right away, like those of us who didn't live that life knew. You are this a horrible storyteller. This, story 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 you. Like this, this was the, like the most amazing year ever. I was like watching and my jaw dropped and I was like, oh my God, this is just so crazy. Wow, it sounds like your jaw is dropped. <laughs> then Jen came out and told her side. It, it all made sense. And, and now she's in jail for six years? Yeah, exactly. In your all imagination, right. when you're drinking. <laughs> No, she is not in jail at all, John. Get your facts.
together. I can't say that other phrase ever again, I don't think. Um, but please, don't confuse your facts. She is not in jail at all. She is wherever her home may be. She is at home. And she seems quite happy. And she's actually really pretty. I saw another picture of her. I'm like, wow, she's so pretty. So she's probably doing way better than you. Right. <laughs> she looks like she's taking a shower. That fell in jail. Okay, let's and talk about her side. Oh, no, 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 no. You want to not change that? Oh, no, no, no. no, 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 no. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, can you get me a spot? Oh, 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 oh. Sorry, oh, honey, I messed up the script outside the hospital. Remember that night? You were outside the hospital. Remember what night? And then Cody was like, I'm sorry, honey. I messed up the script. Oh, my God. Somebody in chat is saying, somebody named Criddlin is saying, this bitch is trolling you. Bitch, your mom should have swallowed. What a waste of oxygen. That is so mean. That is so horrible. Like, what did this Whitney ever do to you that, that you're just talking so disgustingly about somebody he's got on panel? Like, really? You needed to be that nasty? Like, you, uh. No, I never said I messed up the script. I had his phone. In it's the not club, no, no, no. Whitney's trying to be here and trying to school me on everything she thinks she can school me on. Okay, Whitney, you got us on that yeah. one again, girl. You are such an insider. What's the next Can't one? Show the face either. The, uh, the best yeah. video. Let's see, let's see that pretty uh, face of yours. That, that see the face Was either. that your face 40 years ago, Whitney Lee? Yes, exactly. I, uh, well, show it now. Just like your face right now. Well, <laughs> I don't have to hide it. That's real. Yours isn't. <laughs> what does it matter? I'm just a voice. I'm not a face. I'm a nobody. You have all this truth on it. Hey, so Ellie, the mod in the chat, I've been, um, I saw a screenshot. I don't know if I saw the screenshot on Reddit, um, but it was something that Maria said on her IG and I don't follow her. So I know I must've seen it on Reddit or somewhere, but it said that Ellie and Run for the Hills are both Coco Mojito, which is crazy if both of those are, if all three of those people are the same person. So I don't know if Maria is um, talking out of her butt or if that is the case, but I found that to be interesting. That's what me. To go ahead and fucking bash somebody. You come on, face to face with right? You, like, a, you true, a true, a true keyboard stuff. warrior. Look at her. Do you remember when you walked to the cops? Mind. You got us all in suspense. And then what? The oh, no, you have, you have me and Cody in suspense, Chica. What's Look, next? Danielle, where you at? <laughs> Why did you explode on poor Danielle? Only because she had a different opinion. That was so crazy. Do you remember that? Yeah. The that poor lady so told crazy. you don't talk about somebody's record. And I have you, no record. And then you exploded. I've never been arrested. You got, I've never been charged. No, with no about, about no Rocco's record. record. Proved you wrong. You were arrested when you were 18 in Long Island. Record. You were exposing well, Rocco, Rocco. Rocco did hard time and he, yeah. he talked shit about me. You bet. No, he didn't. No, he did. What did he say? What the hell, Rocco? Rocco did hard time and he talked shit about me. Is that a how dare Brooke flirt with him kind of moment? I'm jealous because Brooke flirted with him. He did hard time. What the hell? So you, you have all the evidence, Whitney Lee. Yeah, I have. All, well, all he okay, did was okay, interview okay, Lisa. Okay, you, know, you were jealous. I, you were Rocco so was a drug. Uh, Rocco sold drugs. Uh, he, he was arrested. A big old drug selling. Yeah. Rent. And he changed his life. And you okay, didn't. Well, and he started talking. I didn't know any of these things about Rocco. I didn't even barely know who Rocco was other than somebody that's been around a while that uh, Brooke flirts with. That's all I knew about him. But now I know more if, if that information is correct. But since it's coming out of John's mouth. I don't know. And Lee, that's hilarious. <laughs> Pippi. <laughs> that's fine. I prefer bottom. Talking about me. No, he didn't. Wow, Whitney. Let's get Rocco on the phone right now. And then, then you attacked on that. No, no, let's, let's call Rocco, Whitney. Oh, like Ro I can't stand Rocco, but I'm going to call him. Let's call him, even though I just said I couldn't stand him. <laughs> Rocco said you're you're Let's like Rocco, I know what Rocco why, thought. Why you a rush girl? Rocco thought you're a huge nightmare. 
girl. And he doesn't want to deal with you anymore. Okay. Okay, the poor guy, and he has a family. Why do you want to call him now? I don't know. The people in chat are being really disgusting. Oh, my God. I can't believe I used to be one of these people. Jesus. You're so dumb. I don't know. Cold on that. You're trying to talk me out of it. You're so drunk. Oh, my God. Am I so drunk? People are literally laughing at you. They're DMing Who's laughing at me? We're laughing at you. This can't be alcohol, right? I don't know. I've never been drunk, so... You're like the person at the, at, at, at the club, and you get no fucking laughs at all. Like, Oh, think, honey, I do all the time. Your big moments? So you attacked Dom Natty because you were no, jealous. Yes, nope. you did. You said, oh, my God, he said he no, doesn't even watch the show. I'm, I'm, I'm the... It's not been set up yet. You should, you should leave these people alone. Come on, you're so like drunk or something. I'm so drunk or so, like this. Was that just a flex of him proving he had Rocco's phone number, even though this Rocco has done hard time and was like a leader of a drug ring and, and he doesn't like him? And now he's like flexing, like, look, Rocco's voicemail, man. Yo, what's up? I got I got the digits for Rocco, but he's not taking my calls. This will be like no, that. no. Keep Where's Christy me. Means? No, you keep Where's Christy me means? How drunk I yeah. am. Dom Natty has not been around in five years. Why yeah, are you talking about him? Because it's a true. Dom Natty. I didn't know Dom Natty didn't watch the show, and he's gotten himself way bigger than John. I think I don't really follow him, but I know when I first came into the community, a bunch of people liked him and followed him. I one forty eight really liked him. Maybe that's why John hates him so much. Maybe one forty eight used to give money to Dom and. He thought it should all be his. Rightly, <laughs> me too. Trent, you keep doing. No, I, I don't keep talking about somebody who's not been around in five years. Uh, Rock she said Christy memes. Why aren't you reacting to Christy memes, John? Who blocked you. That's why it went straight to voicemail. <clears throat> he wants okay, nothing to do with you. What? I'm not worried about this. I just spoke to Rocco two weeks ago. When's the last time you spoke to Rocky, uh, Whitney Lee? I'm just... Oh, my God. He's still flexing Rocco, even though he just said he didn't freaking like Rocco. Like, you're such a weirdo, John. Like, how are you... I just... This is annoying as hell. Because you're just, like, going off on what a lousy human being he is. But now you're, like, flexing this Rocco bullshit. And 90% of the people that watch this don't even freaking know who Rocco is. And Nikki, you're right. That's it. He's got a huge media presence and he can get all the interviews with all of the 90 day people that John can't get. And he doesn't watch the show to boot. So that really pisses John off. Lee. <laughs> Lee, that's funny. Saying about no, your reputation. So you're going off on trash. fight that I had with Rocco. Yeah, the fight where you called Danielle. But, but Rocco, oh, you, you, you did an old uh, trash Danielle. To, to and and tell, get hard time for that. And you're trying to put me up against Rocco. You wanted to make money off of arrested. Danielle because Danielle defended right. Rocco. You well, did the only thing. also, not my issue. Yeah, but now but you have why, issues why because you, of the trend. You Danielle? Because of the trends. What you trend? forget, you, you drink What's and trends? you... No one's talking about Danielle Jabali. You have what not... trends? Hey, Johnny Crack. And that's good, Christy. Anybody that's gotten away from this is probably so much happier. Um, or just, you know, living living an exciting life where they don't have time for this. And that's good. So good for her. Well, after Danielle. Agree, Johnny Crack. She is such an MVP. This is amazing watching this. I didn't see the full thing last night. And oh my God, this is amazing. I'm just, I love Whitney Lee. Well, there's other people oh, like no, Dawn no, and no, Ashley no. and Christy. Remember I Ashley. want to know about the Talking about Danielle right now. Remember you when you said Ashley was sleeping in you the same hotel room that. and having sex with a man while you were there sleeping next to her mother? Do you know Four how crazy? Ago. Yeah. Yeah, that's crazy. And you still want to be friends with her? No. Yeah, you tried. No. We saw we saw the lines no, when you were alluding. Four years. No. You wanted so bad to be friends with her no. again. Wrong. You're like, um, Ashley, mean Where? Ashley. Guys, show me. Okay, so Ashley and him and. Ashley's man, I don't know if it was Jay or not, and Ashley's mom all shared a hotel room. And I guess Ashley had relations 
in a bed right next to John and her mom? Is that what Whitney just said? Oh my God. <laughs> that's what, disgusting. If that's what I just actually heard. I know I heard that Ashley was doing the, yeah, that's what I heard. Holy cow. These are some sick, sick people. I was wondering, Nikki, if they were or not. Yeah, I don't blame them either. I mean, besides Paul wanting to make a an X-rated video with him, I don't really know who much supports him. <laughs> where I talked about Ashley at all. Wrong. When Christy Memes came on your life. Oh, my God. Look at her. She got <laughs> the fucking... Oh, Christy. Oh, God. That's not... Christy Memes? You're talking about people who, have, who, have, who are probably dead. Listen. These are people that were, like, George fighting. Washington was a great president. 15 years ago? Like, but, like... So you have no no loyalty to anyone? You're Just, like, I mean, what I happened? About years. Your friend. latest victim. Ask who is the latest victim? R.I.P. That's all I'm going to say. Who is the latest victim? May she rest in peace. That's oh. all I'm going to say. Okay. Okay. Oh, R.I.P. Natalie. Yeah, she owns um a a hair. She does um she owns a hairdresser thing, with or a a beauty salon, <laughs> a hairdresser thing. My brain, my brain is so dumb sometimes. Yep, uh, Pippi, this is it. Johnny Crack TV, right? Or or no, you're HDJ or maybe you're Phil. Secretly, everybody is Phil. Martin's mommy, you're Phil. Pippi, you are now Phil. Pippi, you must be Phil because Pippi is four letters and begins with a P. So you got to be Phil. <laughs> okay, so I'll, I'll, go ahead. No, we're not going to talk about that because there's courts and stuff coming up. Where are you going to live? Are you going to live with Beth? Where's Beth? Beth Mahar? Beth is working at McDonald's in Milan and doing really great and having a great life. Yeah, but she's not supporting you, right? Why would she be? Why would Beth Mahar be supporting me? Because she was killing herself for you. So is that like, so all the cast supports me? What what world are you in, you crazy bitch? (laughs) My gosh. Beth Mahar needs to support me and Cody. She was willing to give you a place to stay. Where's your gratitude? Where is this? Woman? Did you forget? Like she fought now, this guy. So when, please, whenever you see the great Whitney Lee on Reddit, yeah, yeah, or other YouTube chats, just keep these. Just run far away. Here just the all the intelligence she has in her head. Just keep that with you. So now we go to Tanya Maduro. Remember Tanya Maduro? Yeah, I yeah. do remember Tanya. I, I, I don't. You have attacked her for Alzheimer's. no reason. You attacked her like, like, for no is, reason. Is, did the list Yahoo boy give you not working out that well? Now you're just jumping ahead. We'll get to Yahoo why boy. Don't you show your, why don't you show your face there, girl, with the but, list that you have on? She's like, we'll get to Yahoo boy. <laughs> She's amazing. <laughs> we'll get to Yahoo boy. I miss that. I don't. Look, my face you're is... You're very clearly reading off a list. Alcohol-free, drug-free. No, I'm sure the list you're reading off of is alcohol-free, but why don't you just show Cody, the list come back. you're reading off of? Where's the stove? Why isn't it glass? Why isn't the new stove made of... Damn! Enough with that fucking shit. Where's the stove? <laughs> she just kept him coming. God, this, this woman. I want Whitney Lee's autograph. She was just brilliant. <laughs> She needs Alestra for anal leakage. Oh my God, Nikki, that's hilarious. That's right, Danielle's the nurse. John would know a script from a mile away, Martin's mommy. <laughs> Shit, man. So I guess he's making a quick break or something because getting a quick refill, a quick. Sorry, that, you know, I, I kept that going because that is the epitome of craziness. 
that this person is like the face of Reddit. She is like the face of like just put like that dumb face, like that dumb avatar. Like that's the face of like stupidity. I know whenever I think that's something stupid, I will say, oh my god, that's a Whitney Lee. Cause Yeah, and I've got this when I um when I edited the smoke and stuff into it and made it brighter, I put it at 1.5 speed also. So the long pauses are longer than what I've got since I sped it up automatically. Is there is no way anybody could work around that type of stupidity and be okay with it. I mean, it's just like, it, it's insane. Very clearly going off a list that she's been taking copious notes off of for like the last like 10 years. Oh wait, remember when you did this? That wasn't a list. She said she doesn't drink or do drugs. So she's obviously got a brain that can retain a lot of information. And she's been around long enough to see all of this. So it's all fresh in her brain because she doesn't get blackout drunk. So she remembers the shit that you do, unlike you. So this person, mm, now nah, nah, here's my time. Eh. Like, God. I don't even think she's on Reddit. So that's funny. Okay, John, remember four, remember 16 years ago when you cut somebody off at Walmart, John? Remember that, John? John, you don't remember when you cut someone off at Walmart? Don't make fun of her accent. You sound like an ignorant piece of shit when you make fun of people's accents. Just stop. Just if you want to mock her, don't use the accent. God, you're ignorant. You're disgusting. 16 years ago, John. They were painfully weak. I just read a post about it, John. <laughs> oh my God, these crazy people on the internet. It's like just wild, wild, crazy, insane people like Whitney Lee. John, you were online at Burger King exactly 17.8 years ago and you got the last Whopper online. I was behind you and I remember it. I've been, I've been keeping lists since it, John. Like crazy. Like, I don't know what to say other than nothing but stupendous fucking craziness. What about that time when you were at the Jen's house and you were at the, you were at the, the Sands Club in 2017? What about that time? Bitch, how do you know about when I was in Sands Club in 2017? Like, yeah. <laughs> Sam's Club in 2017 was never mentioned, you idiot. It's insane to me. I, I, I will just right. never, you ever, know. ever understand it. And guys, listen. Clearly, this this Whitney Lee knows everything that's going on. So, like, if you need to know the truth about me. Learning you have Hodgkin lymphoma ah. can feel overwhelming. But you can rise to the... I think this one, I actually saw the skip ad and pressed it, but I don't know how much time it took me to do it because it's probably a long health commercial. So I probably hit the skip ad at the very end of the, let's see. Yep. I'm going to have to let it play out because it's, it's going to be more of a hassle for me to fast forward for the one minute, I think. Crazy look. Crazy, crazy. Right? Well, because they were questions that he refused to answer because he had lied about all of it. A Big Mac and a Twinkie. <laughs> Oops, we are back. And th this is the lengths people fucking go to. But I'm the crazy one. Maybe I'm the crazy one. Remember that one. I'm the crazy one. I'm the liar. I'm always making it up. They're always right. They say everything what they want. Listen, um, I, I have their clairvoyance now. Um, I don't know. I'm going to grow to 14 feet tomorrow. My head will be sitting outside my roof. I will have a 30 inch dick. Um, Cody will be the queen of fucking um, Russia. Um, my bookshelf will be in the Smithsonian. Hope will be the biggest cat ever known to man. She? And this is it because I just say things and they're the truth. Allegedly. No, not allegedly. Not allegedly at all. This is this is the truth now. This is how this works these days. So have a great fucking night, y'all. As for me, and like I, I you know, the just 
Whitney and just her beating me across the fucking tracks, just just her schooling me over and over and over again, which is so much, so much, so hard oh. for me. And I have to go. So I wish you well and God bless. And, you know, Cash long live open. Whitney Lee. That's right. Long live Whitney Lee. Woohoo! Go Whitney Lee. Go Whitney Lee. Wow. That really. That really exhausted him um, and made him mad because she spit out so many facts at him that he just couldn't come back quick enough and answer. <laughs> and then she would go on to the new one. And then he acts like he's trying to, he, then he's trying to mock the the lies and the truth and the, the everything. But what pissed me off the most is still how he tried to insult our intelligence by saying that we were the freaking crazy people who said it was the 14th. It's so disgusting. Like it was all him and Julie and Julie was sad begging for him. And now you want to lie and say that you didn't put anybody up to it. So Julie just did it on her own. So you're going to completely throw her under the bus, which fuck, whatever. I don't care. That's on you and Julie to figure that mess out. Yep, Pippi, it absolutely does. <laughs> Disney on ice, that's hilarious. So because you call yourself a princess and do the M, does that make it Disney on ice? 100%. So that is the second live of the night that he did last night. I really just in my soul had to cover it because of that 14th and 15th crap just pissed me off so much. I really had something to say about it. And I wanted to show your crack elves video with it to show, uh, obviously the progression of his arms and how he was lying about that too. So it's together. And then we all know that the blood stains, the blood drops are from when Cody broke his wrist, which or broke his wrist when, Cody punched his fist into the stove. And you can also see that on your Crack Elf's channel. So please, everybody, check out your Crack Elf. Uh, they are amazing and do all the hard work. And I think that covers it. I definitely have some other streams, the older ones that I want to get to. So it all depends on if, on if he lets me or not, because if he's going to keep uh, putting out these foaming at the mouths, then the past streams will be put off a little bit longer. <laughs> so, but I've got some good ones planned or he's going to be foaming at the mouth this weekend. We shall see. Uh, you know what, Pippi? There's actually a calendar that shows he has got, um, over the past several years, people have been able to analyze Right, Nikki, the only elf that uh, you that anybody should love. <laughs> the um that where they have done the analyzing to know exactly when John is gonna go to the hospital and do his hospital grift, when he's gonna do this, when he's gonna do that grift, and everything checks every single box, and it is such a pattern, it's insane. I need to find that chart and uh show it to you guys because a lot of the newer people to this have not seen that chart and the chart is freaking amazing because it is spot on exactly, exactly, exactly <laughs> what happens. Um, like clockwork, it's amazing. So I will uh, get a copy of that chart to show on one of these lives. And with that, I'm going to let everybody move on to the rest of the day and whatever other lives are out there. Um, and replay crew, if you made it this far, I really appreciate you coming back and watching and um, yeah, anybody else that comes back and watches and makes it this far, I so appreciate it. Oh, yeah, the Valjean count. Valjean, I always want to say Valjean. Valjean, because it's Jean Valjean. Thanks, Valorian. <laughs> yeah, the, the Valjean calendar. Oh, cool, okay. I think I have it, but it's really far down in a, in a OneDrive file somewhere. With a billion screenshots that I'll never use that were stupid for capturing. <laughs> so maybe one day I'll take all the screenshots I have and just show them on the screen and we'll decide if I should have kept them or not. That might be a fun game. 
Because I've got so many, some of them don't even make sense. <laughs> so that could be interesting. Anyway, thank you guys very much. Have a great rest of the day, and I will see you next time. And I'm going to play my intro on out of here. My, uh, my intro, my outro. All right, later on, everybody. Shauna, hello and goodbye.